Wayne Cunningham here at the 2013 Detroit Auto Show taking a look at the Volkswagen Cross Blue Concept. Now, this seems like one of the most technically advanced cars at the show, and it could come to production. VW is trying to make a, a business case for it right now. It's got a diesel engine in front, 190 horsepower, and it also has a 54 horsepower electric motor integrated with the double shift gearbox. That's a six speed gearbox, so that makes it a hybrid powertrain. But there's more. It also has a 114 horsepower electric motor on the rear wheels. So that actually gives it all wheel drive. Actually, four wheel drive when you consider they can shift the torque around any way they want. They can throw a bunch of torque to the back, front, it can be working at the same time. It can drive in different modes. It can drive in all wheel drive mode, four wheel drive mode, and also just front wheel drive mode if they just want to economize as much as possible. Now, it's also a plug-in hybrid. We see the plug right here. It's got a 9.8 kilowatt hour lithium ion battery, and it can drive for 14 miles on electric power alone. VW estimates it's gonna get about 89 miles per gallon equivalent, that's taking the electric powertrain into consideration, or 35 miles per gallon just working as a hybrid. It's an interesting form factor too. VW designed this specifically for the North American market. They're calling it an SUV. I'm thinking more like a minivan or crossover. We see a pretty robust hood here, a pretty squared off hood. We have these vents on the top of the hood. That's kind of like Land Rover's done in the past. We also have these LED headlights, and that's, that's more of a concept car element. Probably won't see that come to production. It's actually a six-seater. There's three rows of seats inside, front row, middle row with two independent seats, and a rear row with two independent seats as well, although BW says when it comes to market, it could also have a rear bench and seat seven passengers. The rear seats really come into the rear cargo area, so you want to fold those down. They actually fold flat to maximize the rear cargo space. They've done a few tricks inside, too, with the tech. They've got a couple of mini iPads mounted in the backs of the headrests for the second row passengers. Then the uh, front seat has a 10.2-inch touchscreen LCD. Also, the instrument cluster is an LCD panel. And they've got these uh, metal rings in it to kind of set aside the gauges, make the uh, tachometer and the speedometer look like they're actual analog gauges. Although it will also change theme depending on what kind of mode you're driving in. It's got eco, sport, that sort of thing. If Volkswagen puts this into production, it'll slot between the Tiguan and the Touareg. It'll be one of their newest cars, and they're just trying to figure out if they can uh, make it work right now. I'm Wayne Cunningham here at the 2013 Detroit Auto Show.